running club with an Irish pub as its home base has grown from what started a seemingly unusual partnership to a 15 year long staple of downtown Colorado Springs. It's the anniversary of the Jack Quinn's Running Club, an event also rebounding out of the pandemic. Bill Folsom downtown tonight checking out all that's going on right now. Bill. Yeah, it has really picked up in the last hour. There are a ton of people still out on the course running, but people are coming in. The patio is filled up. This is actually a two story celebration. The windows are open. They got a band going upstairs. This is an anniversary with an element of reunion. The club had to scale way back through the pandemic. It modified somewhat with a virtual elements this evening for the anniversary. It is in person with food and drink, even that band. An idea for a social running club at a social pub. This is video of year one. It started with just over 50 people. It quickly grew to hundreds each Tuesday. It has taken on a life of its own. We've had couples meet here at the running club and get married and you know it's it's a really social thing. A transplant to Colorado Springs came up with the idea and approached Jack Quinn's managers. They agreed to sponsor social running outside to get socializers inside after the run. Hang out, have some really good deals on good food and and drinks and meet people. 15 years, 780 runs, 2,418 miles. And if you're asking how many numbers, in 15 years, we've seen over 40,500 people run at least one time with Jack Quinn's Running Club. It's super exciting. It does almost feel like a turning point tonight. An anniversary party was in question earlier this year. It turned to a full on celebration a little over a month ago. COVID-19 rules eased, allowing for a larger party, giving this party added meaning. A kickoff to normalcy. Great, but there is also a business element to this. It's been very important to the business to have these runners come down here on Tuesday night. It gets them in here. It also gets them into other businesses. That carries over into the end of the pandemic. People are now coming downtown, can see what's open, get things rolling again in the downtown area. Watching out for you, Colorado Springs, Bill Folsom, News 5.